Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. So if you're new here, my name is Anushka. Today we're going to be doing, um, I would say like a self in self Indian bridal makeup look. I'm going to try my best to do one. Obviously I've been to Chennai and I've seen um, a few weddings and their jewellery, just their jewellery alone is very like a warm gold. That's why I thought I'd wear this, this jewellery for this video. I don't know where this is from. This is my mum, so... Please don't ask me, I honestly don't know. But you can get a bunch of Indian jewellery from Southall, Green Street, if you're in the London area. Yeah, I thought, let me wear this really, like, warm gold jewellery. I'm going to do, like, a gold, but really, like, smoky cat-eye liner with a flick here. I really want it to be, like, shh, do you know? Before we jump to the video, I'm going to first do my post notification shout-out for today. And today, we're going to be doing it for... Today's one's going to go to Alicia Lode, so thank you so much for watching my video and leaving a nice comment. If you guys want to get one next time, all you have to do is subscribe, press the bell button and then let me know in the comments below, or you can just leave a nice comment. Okay, let's start then. I mean, I need to do my brows, so I'm going to start with that. I'm going to use the Precisely My Brow Pencil in the shade 5 by Benefit. Me, we're gonna order McDonald's today and you guys know I love me at some McDonald's and I was watching McDonald's videos and I was craving and I've been collecting the Monopoly stickers and I'm so close to getting a £2,000 holiday which I need very urgently but yeah I'm asking him to wait before he orders because I want to order too but then it's like £3.50 delivery charge and you know there's no point of us paying it twice when we could just pay it once I'm also going to use some of my Benefit Gimme Brow in the shade 6. I know I use a lot of Benefit brow products, but they're honestly the best ever. And I want this look to look good, good. So, another one that I've been using a lot is the Maybelline one, the Sensational Brow Pencil in dark brown. And I've been using that on a daily because it's just really quick and easy to do. I'm just taking some of the foundation that I'm going to be using today and just carving out my brows. so satisfying oh chichi or no i think we're going to start with the eyes because we're going to use some black so we're going to prime them first i don't know where i put my p louise eye base i thought i should use that today but i literally don't know where i put it do you know what i'm just gonna use my tarte shape tape my favorite concealer of life let's just put that one there I know Gigi. Sometimes I swear he talks to me. Someone commented on one of my ins a recent Instagram posts that they wanted me to use the Huda Beauty Remastered Gold Palette. And Rose Gold Remastered Palette, that's how you say it. So I'm going to be using that and I need a good black anyways. And the black in here is just absolutely stunning. So I'm going to be using this palette today. I think I'm going to use Sandalwood. I'm really going to like wing this out, not too far though. Yesterday I took the time to really clean my brushes, so it's just so good when you have like clean brushes ready. Next shade I'm going to grab is Coco, but I'm just going to like put that in the outer corner here. And we're going to blend this on the outer corner. I'm also going to grab this Kiko palette. This is the Cult Eyeshadow palette in... It's called Smart. And we're going to grab this beautiful gold shade right here. I am going to wet it though. With some spray. Spray. Actually, do you know what? I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna use some of my. I'm gonna use some of my NYX glitter primer because that stuff like really emphasizes everything. So. Putting this all over my lid. And then I'm gonna pack that shadow on. Ew! That 
that just matches the jewelry so nicely i'm gonna do the same on the other side I'm just grabbing a bit of sandalwood and I'm gonna just touch up some bits. I'm gonna use the Clinique High Impact Eyeliner. Do a quick liner. Sometimes when you're using like crayons to do your liner, it's a bit easier to like, well, I find it easier to like pull my eye because I don't want it to be neat. If you're going to do a wing liner, then maybe don't do that. Okay, so now we're going to grab the shade Black Truffle from the Huda Beauty palette and we're going to basically pack the eyeshadow on it. I'm going to use my Ol Henriksen True Serum. Ol Henriksen, yeah, I think that's how you say it. I'm just going to apply this all over. For foundation today, I'm going to use my Makeup Forever Ultra HD foundation in the shade Y445. This foundation is so nice. I forgot how good it was. Really hydrating. I don't know if I should do some cream contouring or not. Hmm. I feel like there's something missing from the eyes, so I'm gonna use some of these. <sighs> Just hang on, let me get it out. Let me get it out. I think I'm gonna put some of this uh, gold chains shade from the Huda Beauty Matte Metals Shadows. This shade right here. I just feel like my eyes are just. I know it matches the. The eyeshadow, the jewelry a lot, but I just need like a bit of something, you know. <laughs> Put some on the back of my hand, and I'm just gonna just kind of like pop it on top. Then for concealer, I'm gonna grab my Fenty Beauty Pro Filter concealers in 300 and 330, a mix of two. Gonna blend that in. For powder, I'm gonna use this Beauty Bakery flower powder in the shade yellow. Just gonna bake. So whilst that's setting, I'm going to use my Hula Caramel. Okay, I'm just going to brush off all this excess. Powder. I'm just going to take the bronzer with a small like flat brush and I'm just going to kind of like define my nose. I just feel like I have to go with a red lip with this look, but anyways, we'll see. I'm gonna grab that same, I'm gonna grab that same eyeliner by Clinique and we're gonna 
line our lash line water line I mean top and bottom that just adds everything doesn't it gosh my butt hurts from sitting down all day I've been filming all day long but anyways okay so I'm gonna take my benefit eyeliner again and we're gonna I really want to do like extend it here. Right, I'm going to take Coco from the Huda Beauty eyeshadow palette and bring out really close to my lash line. Just going to blend it on that outer corner of it. I'm gonna pack on some of my L'Oreal Paradise Ecstatic Mascara because it's just so good. Oh, these lashes, by the way, I didn't even say what they was. These are, these are the Lights Camera London Cosmetic Lashes in London. So yeah. Okay, we gotta do we gotta do some blush now, shall we? I'm using the Cheek Leader Pink Squad palette by Benefit and I'm packing on this shade right here which is a nice really pretty like shimmery shade. I'm just because this is a palette that's more for like lighter skin tones I can go a bit more heavy handed on them but I'm just blending it all over. I'm also going to use the highlight that's in here because it's so intense. Do you see what I mean? Oh, we could go with this. Let's try this at least. Let's try it. Gonna use the Kat Von D Bachelorette liquid lipstick. I'm loving this. I am love. Big all right guys this is the finished look i hope you enjoyed this south indian inspired wedding look oh my god i wouldn't mind having this eye makeup for a wedding look don't know about the lip but i'm not mad at it this whole look is so stunning with the jewelry i'm using this um crop top from pretty little thing like this would wear really well with um any saris to be honest but yeah Give this video a big thumbs up and if you want to see more Indian wedding party get ready with me's or inspired looks let me know. And yeah, I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next one.